Howdy, I'm Chuck with Simply Nook, and this is Chimney Rock, the latest long life nook from Simply Nook. And starting as we do with the front, we have the optional HD audio jack. Future versions would not have this audio jack. We have uh, two Type C USB ports, which has USB 3.2 Gen 2, so these are 10 gigabit. Alternate display port is on both of these, so you can drive monitors from the front. And Thunderbolt 3 is available on both connectors. One of them is a single stream, and the other one is dual stream. You can see our two USB Type A ports, and these are also USB 3.2 Gen 2 10 gigabit. And we have our illuminated power button. Uh, this button will have a ring lit up when the unit's on, and it will be blinking when it's in standby, obviously off when it's off. And this is part of our rock series. So this one is chimney rock. Taking a look at the side, we have a large inlet uh, ventilation for cooling. And the other side, we have a large inlet as well. Looking at the back, starting from the left, we have our three point, I'm sorry, our 5.5 by 2.5 center positive DC jack. And we supply a 19 volt brick, uh, 90 watt brick with the unit. The unit will run on a wider voltage, but uh, we do supply the 19 volt brick. We have two more USB 3.2 Gen 2 10 gigabit type A ports. We have a um, HDMI 2.0B. This is 4 gig, I'm sorry, 4K at 60 hertz. And we have a display port, and this is display port 1.4, as well as the two front ports are also display port 1.4. And so you can daisy chain multiple monitors off of either of the front uh, type A ports, um, type C ports, or the back display port. We have two Ethernet ports. One is 2.5 gigabit and the other one standard gigabit. So this gives you not only two ports, but the new 2.5 gigabit. The lid is replaceable, just like the normal uh, lids you're familiar with. And when the lid's removed, you can see the two Wi-Fi antennas, uh, Bluetooth and uh, wireless AX. You can also see that there's some additional cooling. So for functional lids that have electronics in the lid, you actually get cooling for that electronics. And just popping the top off, as you can see, you would also get some additional cooling. Taking a look at the bottom, we have our, uh, this one has windows and has our barcoded sticker, but this is the product sticker. And then, Taking the bottom plate off, there's four number two Phillips head screws. All right, taking a look at the inside, you can see that we have on the bottom plate our SSD cooler for the 2280 SSD that's inside. And we have a, a second 2280 SSD uh, slot. So you can put a SATA SSD here in the bottom, and then there's a cooler plate for the SSD that's inside. Inside we have our 2280 SATA or PCI Express SSD. We have two DDR4 3200 slots. We also have underneath the 2280 SSD, we have a radio. This is the wireless AX, AX200 uh, radio, Wi-Fi 6. And it is socketed, so it can be replaced or removed. So you can see kind of the um, inside. We do have our front panel header where the power button and power LED is plugged. And we have headers for serial ports, RS-232 serial as well as USB ports for functional lids. 
This is a number zero Phillips head for taking the 2280 radio out and also for the SSD that's under, or the radio that's out underneath the SSD on top. So that's a look at the inside. So head on over to simplynook.com, check out the links below, find the right chimney rock for you and order it today. Thank you.